Hi everyone and welcome. In this video we will see how you can control the GPIO of Luxfox Pico Ultra W RB1106 Linux Micro Development Board. In the previous video we have covered that how to install Python Periphery Library on the Luxfox Pico Ultra W for the GPIO control. Okay. And now in this video we are going to actually control the GPIO. Here on the camera you can see I have this Luxfox Pico Ultra W board and I have connected this LED on the pin number 41. Now how to get the pin numbers? So you can visit the documentation page, okay? And here you can see the pin numbers, okay? So right now my LED is connected on the pin number 41, okay? And the ground of the LED is connected to the last pin. Okay, you can see here. So this is the pin number 41 and this is the last pin in first column. Okay, so I have uh, connected this two cable with the LED. Now we want to control this LED. Okay, we want to control the status of the LED. Turn on or turn off. Then how we can do that. Okay, so for that we already know that we can use the Python periphery library. Okay, so first let log into the terminal of Luxfox Pico Ultra W. So I am running Ubuntu operating system inside my Luxfox Pico Ultra W. So I am going to use this SSH command. Okay, we'll log into the uh, Luxfox Pico Ultra W and then we'll run Python 3. Okay, so we are successfully login. Now here you can see I have provided the entire code to control the GPIO. So first of all, you have to open the Python 3 terminal. Okay, now let me clear the screen. Let me make it bigger for you. Okay, sudo python3 and you have to provide the password which is luckbox. Okay, we are successfully inside the python terminal. Now, first of all, we have to import the GPIO library or you can say python periphery library. Okay, so we are going to copy this command. We'll paste that here and then we will hit enter. And no error means everything is good. Now, we have to define that on which pin we are going to write the data, okay, or we are going to read the data. So, right now, we are going to write the data on pin number 41, okay, so that's why I have created this variable that write pin is equal to 41. Then after we have to set the mode, okay, like we are going to provide the output to that pin or we are going to sense the data from that pin, okay, so that you can do using this command GPIO and then pin number, okay, and you want to set this pin to the output, okay, or you want to set the mode to output or input that you have to define here. So we are going to set it as an output, so you can copy this, you can paste that here and then you can hit enter. Then after here is a command to turn the LED on and here is the command to turn the LED off. So first of all, we'll copy this command to turn on the LED. Okay. We'll paste that command here and then I'll hit enter. Okay. So let's check the wiring first. Okay. So LED is on. Sorry for the wiring mistake. Okay, here you can see LED is on. Okay, now I can run the command for false. Okay, to turn off the LED. And here you can see LED is off. I can again turn on the LED. Okay, you can see LED is on. I can again turn off the LED. Okay, we can again turn on and we can again turn off. Okay, so this is how you can control the GPIO of your Luxbox Pico Ultra W using Python Periphery Library. Okay, and we have already covered that how you can install Python Periphery Library in Luxbox Pico Ultra W. So if you don't have Python Periphery Library installed in your system or installed in your Luxbox Pico Ultra W, then you can refer the previous video. And if you have already installed, then you can, you know, follow this uh, command set to control the GPIO. After that, you can, you know, create the entire Python command to control the GPIO as per your requirement. Okay, but this is just a demo that you can use periphery library to control the GPIO. Okay, so I hope this thing is clear. And if you still have any questions or any doubt in the GPIO control, then you can always ping me on Telegram, Instagram, WhatsApp, anywhere. Also, you can comment on this video. Also, you can send me a mail. Also, you can ping me on LinkedIn. 
now let's meet in the future videos okay so till then take care goodbye and thank you